This quick video will show you how to use the morph program from the remote machine, the morphed remote machine. So right here on my desktop is the morphed remote machine. Um, and Joe, I'll send you the credentials in case you don't have them already. Um, and so we've got a couple folders here. This morphed release DLLs is the folder that will launch morphed. And so in here we just have all the DLLs and the structure set up so that it all works correctly. Um, to run morphed, we're just going to double click the morph GUI.exe. Um, this tutorial I'll just show you how to use the output viewer, which is very simple. Um, just click on output viewer and it brings this up. Now, this folder down here, the Feshi 2003, 13 November 2014, that's a simulation folder for Morphed. And we'll look in here really quick. You can see we've got the inputs, outputs, temporary folder, and then these two dot .morph files. The display.morph is what you open in the viewer to display everything. The dot .morph is the XML the GUI creates and runs Morph from. So what we're going to do here is in the viewer, file, open project, um, it will navigate to our desktop to the Feshi 2003 simulation and double click the display.more file and from here we can click through the floods. Um, the viewer isn't totally 100% functional yet. You can view everything just fine. Um, these pie charts should work just fine. Um, but as far as the graphs and final graphics and things, we're not there yet, but um, we have something. So if I let you know that you have these things up on the rem remote machine, you can come look at them yourself um, at your own pace if my videos go too fast. So there you go.